Hello everybody, today we're going to continue talking about this new novel, Satellite. Portion contains third-party content, constitute fair use, works are meant to be educational, scholar nature, scientific research. And this novel is just an opinion speculation, and no matter where you want to pass any of third-party content, is our own. Chapter Moon just about every culture has stories of people and creatures living on the moon, Earth's only satellite. Now an eye-opening video seems to raise the idea that legends could be right and that we are humans may not have been just first or even most recent visitors to our nearest neighbor, moon. In Moscow, Russia, in May 2019, a photographer said that, um, a shoot full moon over the sea and he struggled to get um, focused and they leave him more with little just little than moon stock. First black circus, circles crossed in front of the moon and almost as soon they pass, um, even more came up. After stabilizing the frame and zoom, there is no question, is it a cluster of objects is flying on a loose formation? Could the circular objects be asteroids or fleet of alien craft maybe? The famous photographer calculates the site based on the moon's diameter and estimate orbit about 60 miles above the surface. If these objects were orbiting the moon, they would have to be two or three miles wide. If they are UFOs, they would be almost the 40 times size of the um, largest craft in Earth's orbit, International Space Station. So who and what is capable of building so many superstructures and putting them into lunar orbit? So are we looking into something huge orbiting the moon like a fleet of UFOs or just cluster of asteroids? Or we're talking about their own perspective, maybe? Is it just uh, something smaller and closer to us, maybe? Many experts suggested um, that it might be, the picture is real, not photographic and trickery, and um, using good lens of a camera, you actually can zoom in very close to the moon and you can see a lot. And uh, this is actual image from this camera, so could be just oversized satellites put into lunar orbit, or there are a lot of spa spacecraft orbiting the moon. But they are not in the same orbits, they are not just in the same areas. Another important fact is hundreds of astronomers observe the moon every day and night. So if anything odd popping up in an orbit would have set a lot of alarms all over the world. And still NSA think they might be satellites not just the moon's orbit but in our hours orbit. That would make sense because it's getting crowded in a space and um, there was actual clusters of satellites like space, SpaceX Starlink network. The company has already launched over 1,700 so far and with option to add another 10,000 satellites. This seems to be the case closed, except in studying the video more closely, we see something that doesn't match up with satellites. The objects are coming closer to each other and then getting far away. Satellites don't do that. So it negates the possibility that uh, these are not just the satellites. And maybe uh, we are actually looking at the birds. Please leave a comment. The birds and their flapping wings from the silhouettes that appear on the camera sensor can be as round objects. And it very likely we are looking at migrating birds of some kind. Satellites don't speed up and slow down. And video was shot and made during migration. So are we going to call this one migrating birds event? Or maybe it's still um, alien spacecraft. Still is, uh, the space around the moon could get getting crowded indeed. And they say Artemis program aims to return humans there by 2024. And Jess Bezos and Elon Musk plan to build a lunar basis on the moon. And uh, our moon is so brilliant tranquil and throughout the time it has been complete mystery to everybody so for centuries uh, there have been stories told and sonnets have been written about the moon in fact our life revolved around the moon with every seasonal challenge and chilling and change in every present the moon lights our weight in a dark night and uh, gently guides the weather across the world Without the moon, the earth probably be, would be silent, dark and dead. And we are told the moon uh, has been there or before even earth. In the first place, there are many common theories. 
for existence of the moon and all been proven wrong. The most common is giant impact theory, the idea that another stellar body collided with Earth and created the moon. However, an isotopic signature of Earth and Moon are identical, and this negates the idea that another planetary body from someone else crashed into Earth and formed the Moon. A question is another hypothesis that states that uh, Earth and Moon formed together as a double system uh, from primordial accretion disk of the solar system. The problem with this theory it doesn't explain the angular momentum of Earth and Moon system or why Moon has relatively small and no uh, iron core compared to Earth's one, and why Moon doesn't revolve. The notion that the Moon was captured by Earth is another popular theory. However, Moon is too big just to be captured, and uh, then having taken up nearly a perfect circular orbit around the Earth uh, seems un unlikely. And then there is the f fission hypothesis that stated that during the time the Earth was forming, and was still molten and spinning out the planet, planetary projected material, which became later Moon. The Pacific Ocean of Earth was supposedly the area where the Moon came from, and her, where, however, this was the bank considering immaturity of the ocean flow crust and knowing the Moon form at the time much further than in the past. Then there is a problem with the Moon itself. There are number of strange facts about the Moon which uh, conjure up many questions about its existence. The first of which is the Moon's age. The Moon is far older and previously explained and even maybe older than Earth and Sun together. The oldest age for Earth is estimated to be uh, 4.6 billion years and the uh, old Moon rocks were dated about uh, 5.3 billion years. And the dust upon them, which were resting, was at least another one billion year old. Some argue the moon may seem older only because its surface never renew itself, where on Earth uh, rocks um, that might be old, but uh, they been recircled through the natural resurfacing of the planet. So there is simply there is no way to know for sure the chemical composition of, of dust upon the moon rocks that differ remarkably from rocks themselves. And rocks have, uh, have to come from somewhere else, probably. Meteors and asteroids crashing onto the surface of the moon would account for age difference. However, if this is the case, um, then we should have a multitude of different ages in all rock studies and formation. This wasn't the case because normally planetary composition results in heavier elements in the core and lighter materials at the surface. There is a theory that moon is actually an alien spaceship. Craft. Several geologists proposed the refractory compounds that were brought to the moon surface in a great quantity on purpose in, by someone, uh, someone unknown. They don't know exactly how and by who. Mysterious water vapor has been detected on the moon as well. Lunar instruments placed by astronauts recorded a vapor cloud of water passing across the surface and the clouds lasted about 14 hours, covered an area about 100 square miles, moon rocks were magnetized. This was odd because there is no magnetic field on the moon itself and the still rocks were magnetized, and there is still a seismic activity. Hundreds of moon, moon quakes are recorded each year and cannot be attributed to meteor strikes. In November 1958, Soviet astronomer Nikolai Kazrev of Crimea Astrological Observatory photographed the gaseous eruption of the moon near the crater Alphonsus. He also detected reddish glow that lasted about an hour, and a 1963 astronomer at Lowell Observatory also saw reddish glows and the crest of ridges in Arcarius region. And observations have proved to be precisely identical, periodically repeating themselves as the moon moves closer to Earth. Could this be natural phenomena? According to science, the moon has no geologic activity. All of this brings us to the most unusual truth about the moon. The moon is not just a solid object, it's indeed hollow. So moon's mean density is like 3.34 times an equal volume of water where Earth is a 5.5. It means for these equations to be correct, the moon must have, must have been hollow object.